Okay guys, well I'm trying out something a little different this week. I'm trying to film in my living room because I noticed in the last video it focused on my Judge Dredd helmet on my bed and not on me, which sucks because it came out all blurry. So, ta-da, my living room. Hopefully this works out and it's not too noisy because I'm, my living room window is literally facing the street. So, sorry if there's any noise or my dog barks. Um, thank you again for joining me. Um, I'm hoping every time I make one this gets a little better and a little better. Um, and together we can find out about these week's releases because I've never kept up on releases this hard, this much, and so much comes out every week. I know I say this every <laughs> video, but so much comes out, it's overwhelming. So with that, let's go into the indie releases for this week. Okay guys, we're starting off this week's indie portion with Eat Me, Ink Me, and the print previews for The Orchard and Walls of Wallachia, which uh, features a guy known as Dracula that I can't remember his actual name right now. Um, and then they also had an actual picture of the Marble Gates print and design. So I really love classical art prints. I'm hoping this will be good, especially the Dracula one, because if any, if I buy any of these, it'll be the Dracula one. Um, so if you're interested, keep an eye out for Eat Me, Eat Me. Um, and then we're going to move over to Winter's End by Heaven's Atrium. Atrium? <laughs> it's a super cute GSK with, I love the neckline of it. It has a little dip, which I think is like the oh, sweetheart neckline. Yeah. Um, super cute, super wearable. Uh, I love um, school looking JSKs and I also love printed ribbon, which is one of my favorite details a designer could put in on, onto a dress. I love it. Um, and we also have Dolby, who just released their tea table dress. Um, Dolby is from here in Southern California where I live and she releases a bunch of different colors and a bunch of different sizes more importantly so if you are um, on the plus size spectrum and you want to look for something um, that has the right shape because I think it's very important uh, when you get into the bigger sizes to keep the Lolita as a silhouette not to lose it and Dolby does a really good job of that um, you can put a bunch of petticoats on there it'll look fantastic Okie doke, and that with that, we're going to move over to the Japanese releases. Okie doke, to start off the Japanese releases, we have Alice and the Pirates with their Ange et Diable design. It comes in white, it comes in black. I can't say I'm a really big fan of it. It's, it's cute, but I'm not going to go out and buy it, probably. Well, most definitely. <laughs> and then after that, we have uh, Fairy in the Candy World, which I do greatly prefer. It kind of looks like a magical girl costume. I love that. Um, and kind of a sister design. They have Starry Dreamy Long OP, the Long OP. And it looks a little bit like pajamas, but it's also super cute. Um, it comes with sacks, ivory, and off white. And I kind of love this too. Um, to finish up, they have the Doki Doki Strawberry Magic Reservation. Um, I can't say it's much that much different from other summer strawberry prints that every year a lot of the sweet companies put out. But you know, choose your favorite one. You got your strawberry print, or just have a whole strawberry wardrobe. How's that? <laughs> and then we have Physical Drop with a 25th anniversary nurse soapy that comes in black and white and red and white and I have to say I greatly prefer the red and white because it, the nurse thing comes off so much more. Um, I really do love nurse motifs. I personally don't have any but I really do like looking at other cords that are nursey, um, especially with the meta pieces but this physical drop one I also like a lot. Um, and then right after that, we've got Sheglet, which my friend Ashley actually introduced me to the brand Sheglet. It is uh, super good for like goth, classic 
basics and they just released uh, more versions, a lot of their stuff. Um, they also released like a long kimono shape OP. I can't say I'm a big fan of that one, but I am a big fan of their like corsets with the, the ruffles on the side. Like they have various designs like that, like corsets with other extra stuff added and I'm totally here for that. I love it. Um, <laughs> and then after that, let's see what we got here. We've got Meta. Ah. So I am super excited about something. Apart from re-releasing, um, a super cute skirt design in either pinstripe or not pinstripe in dark blue, brown, and black. Which, I mean, super cute, basic, but what I'm super excited for another super cute basic is their platform shoes, otherwise known as the stripper shoes, um, <laughs> in black enamel, so shiny, uh, black matte, and white. Um, I'm a really big fan of these shoes. I super love them. In fact, I bought some other platform Demonia shoes because they weren't restocking these. So I don't know if I should invest in some black matte ones, but it's so tempting. It's so old school. So, so every time I think of that, I think of Motier and like that Kara Snap goth. Ah, I love them. Um, I'm so glad they have restocked. Go get some. Everybody needs these shoes. They're almost as iconic as rocking horse shoes, in my opinion. And then after that, we have Royal Princess Alice with their Dreamy Tarot um, print. Mm, I'm not super into super busy sweet stuff, or bittersweet, or pastel goth. I don't know, but I, I'm gonna pass on this one. Uh, and then right after that we have Angelic Pretty, which I just happen to be wearing today, uh, Wonder Party. Oh no, <laughs> I just noticed that. Okay, we have, uh, we're starting off with Bunny's Bakery OP, the set. Um, I super love bunny stuff. I have a couple of bunny cords, um, so I super love this. I don't wear a lot of light blue, so I probably won't get it, but I super, super love it. Um, it comes with the mini hat, with the bunny ears, the apron, and the OP. So, I mean, super cute. I love it. Um, we also have the Bright Sugar series, which I can't say I like. <laughs> I don't like it at all, but I know of other people who are going to like it. I don't know, maybe it's just the photography that makes it look not that appealing. I think it might have been the pictures. Maybe if I see this in real life, I'll be like, <gasps> um, but I am not blown away right now. They also released with this um, matching katsus in different various colors, uh, headdresses, um, and also they're doing a release, uh, more release of their Lo Love Heart logo bag in seven colors. Some of the colors are exclusive to particular stores like Shinjuku and Tokyo. Um, you might have to get an SS for those shopping service and go get you those bags. But other bags are gonna be available online for everybody. But if you're looking for a very specific color, um, get an SS. I can't say that they're that special that you should spend more money. <laughs> Especially since a lot of brands, different brands have just heart purses, but if you really need that AP one, you really need that um, pink Tokyo Store exclusive, go spend that money. Also, I think this is the first time this is happening, correct me if I'm wrong, but they're doing a made to order space lollipop thing. Um, not that they haven't done made to orders before, but this is the f first time? recently that they've done a made to order right after the release of the JSK. I mean, I know Holy Lantern got a ton of re-releases and re-releases and made to orders and blah, 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 blah. But this is the first time, <laughs> did people really go that crazy over Space Lollipop? How come we haven't gotten this for other things? Are you gonna get it later? Like, is everybody who wants one gonna be able to get one? 
um, cause that'd be awesome. So, made to order, space lollipop. Go get yours if you did not survive the bloodbath. Okay, so for this week's Tab Out Top 5, I'm not starting off necessarily with something I liked, but something that deserves being talked about um, because of its very unique feature of a little quilted heart pooch thing <laughs> that it's got on the front. Um, this is Eat Me by Classical Puppets. It comes in two different colors, and that better be a pocket because <laughs> I can't say it's the best looking thing in the world, but I definitely see how it would appeal um, to a lot of people. It's, it's cute, but it's not for me. Um, but it definitely is a unique feature. Um, up next, we have Angel's Heart with Cute Poodle. I'm a big fan of dogs. I'm a big fan of that heart. It's got right in the middle there. I think it's super cute. Um, and I do love black and like pinks and purples, so... I love this one. Okay, up next, again, for another week, Pretty Rock Baby with another celestial print. What are they doing to me? They want all of my money because I love it. And I love celestial prints. This is gonna come in a couple of colors. It's gonna go in blue. It's gonna come in black and purple. And ah, it's so beautiful. I love dark blue and I love stars. Okie doke. Up next, we've got Dolores doll with this super cute old school style JSK. I love the apron look. I love uh, the red and the and the white. I it, 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 I love the old school feel. It's so good. I love it. And um, the designer slash manager has um, done everybody the favor of <laughs> uh, making it orderable through eBay instead of Taobao, because some people find it hard to order on Taobao. Now, I don't find it that hard, but if you don't, if you can't get the hang of it, she does have an eBay link, which I will put in the bottom. Okie doke. And then, my number one this week is Hinanakuina, Hinanakuina, <laughs> with their, um, let me look up the name real quick, uh, Fairy Doll OP. JSK. It comes in different colors. It's so simple, yet it has so much detail, and I just love, love nice, classic, wearable. Just, it's so cute. It's all of those words I just said. It's that word salad, <laughs> but it's a really good word salad with like feta cheese on it and ranch and chicken. Sorry, I, I, I eat gross salads. <laughs> and it's just, oh. I want to add it to my collection of non-print classic red and black um, stuff, items <laughs> that I've become obsessed with. I have to admit, I no longer wear super sweet prints like this. Um, this I actually bought was one of my first, not one of my first, but definitely a purchase I made back when I was on the sweeter side of things. And this is kind of like a makeup hair outfit, slightly test for the Wonder Party something fantastic wonder party something that's gonna happen in San Francisco in June. I bought my ticket. So hopefully I get to meet some of you guys there. Um, I hope to see you there. Um, if this is the end of the video, this is, uh, we've been through the top five. There's a lot of good stuff this week. If you'd like to follow me on Instagram, I'm at Alice in the Southlands. Um, that's about it. I don't really have much else. Subscribe if you'd like to like it if you'd like to and uh, keep tuning in every Friday for more um, updates on what's coming out this week more things to throw your money at bye